All right, guys. So a lot of you want to run uh, another program using C++ code, okay? So essentially, you want to develop a program that uh, invokes other programs, okay? So this is what I'm going to show you in this video, okay? So we have the outside program, okay? This program uh, prints on the outside program, okay? We have the main directory here. In the main directory, we have the main directory program, okay? This says um, the main directory program. We have our, our invoker, which is uh, where we are going to develop our code to run other programs, okay? And we have the inside directory as well. So the inside program uh, prints out on um, the inside program, okay? So let's go to our invoker uh, file, okay? So what do you need to write here to call other programs, okay? So first of all, let's see how I'm going to call the executable file that's in the same directory as my as my executable file, as my invoker uh, program, okay? So how is the invoker program I'm going to call some other program that is in the same directory as uh, as it is, okay? So this is very straightforward. You write down system, okay? And you just write down the name of the file you want to run. So in this case, it's my directory, main directory program. So if you go ahead and you build this, okay, and we open like CMD here. Okay, let me zoom this for you. Okay, here, just make this bigger. So if I call now uh, invoker, okay, if I call these. It's going to output um, the main directory program, okay? Uh, this handle in here was before because uh, our window is smaller. Let me make this bigger. So yeah, as you can see here, if I run invoke.exe, it's just going to output um, the main directory program. So it essentially invokes, it runs uh, the other program here. So this program, okay? So uh, how do you call uh, some program that is in the inside directory, okay? So if I were in the CMD again, so let's go to CMD. And let me just put this here, clean this. So if I want to run a uh, sub-program with a CMD that is inside uh, our directory, so right now we are in the main directory. So we want to go in the inside directory and run the inside program, is what it's called, okay? So what you do is this, you write down, uh, okay, inside directory. Then you put a backslash to go in the directory and write down inside program.exe, okay? So you're essentially, essentially running the executable file that's located in the inside directory, okay? So as you can see, it runs, it says, I'm in the outside, in, I'm in the inside program. So the same principle uh, that you used in the command line, you're going to use in the system command, okay? Because essentially what the system command does that we are calling here, is it runs a command in the CMD when you're in Windows and in the shell when you're in, in Linux, okay? So what we need to write down here is system, okay? Inside directory, let me put this it's as a string, okay? So inside directory, okay? And now uh, use double backslash because if you use one backslash, it, uh, it's a special character in C++, so you, do, you use double backslash to cancel the special the speciality of uh, that character. And you write down the name of your program, inside program. So this is going to run the inside program. Okay, so we build the invoker. We go in the command line, and if we say in this, so invoker.exe. So we run the invoker.exe program, but this is going to call another program the inside directory program, okay? So as you can see, it says I'm um, in the inside program, so it runs the inside program, okay? So the same is the same principle, so you can do the same uh, for the outside program, okay? So how would you uh, use CMD to run the outside program, okay? You you will write down uh, two dots, okay? To go uh, one directory back, then uh, slash, and then you essentially write down the name of the program. So, so it's outside program, so as you can see, it says I'm in the outside program. So you do the same, you just actually copy this again here. You go in your uh, invoke program, you paste this here, okay? Again, you remove the speciality of your character, 
the backslash character. So dot dot double slash and the name of the, of the program is in the outside directory. Okay, so you essentially need to do the same when you want to run, to run some other program uh, in your computer. You do essentially the same thing. You write down its directory uh, and you run it. Okay, so you, you actually navigate with the command and you use that navigation command to go to that directory and be able to run your program. Okay, so it's very straightforward. You write down system, the directory of your program. If it's in the same directory as you, just write its name and you can run the program. You can run another program. So let's build this and show you that uh, this, works are, this works as well with the outside program. So, C is the rest. so if I call invoke here, so let's say I'm in the outside program. So it runs the outside program. So that's pretty much it for the video, guys. That's how you run another program using uh, C++. In fact, you can use the system command to run whatever you want, like uh, as, as if you were uh, in the CMD. So it's actually, you have the command line in your program. So if I were to output dir here, so it's going to output the directory contents of my directory. So let me build this. Let me show you again that this works. So if I run now invoke.exe, as you can see, it, output, it outputs uh, the contents of my uh, directory. It's, it's actually just, just like running the dir command in CMD. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the video, guys. I hope this helped you. If it did, leave it a like. Subscribe to the channel and I will see you in whatever I will be making next. Goodbye.